Some people think old stuff is just rubbish, but Mum taught me how to find hidden gems. Careful with those. Uh, Jess knows what she's doing. We're in here all the time, aren't we, Babs? Looking for priceless treasures to make our fortune. Mum, look. How much? Seeing as it's you two. When Mum was my age, she lived in a children's home. It had a proper name, but she only ever called it the dumping ground. All she wanted was to live with her mum in their own home. So I'm living my mum's dream. But my mum's story had a happy ending when she was adopted by my granny, Camilla Lawson, who's a real published writer. I could imagine. How do I know all this? Because my mum became a writer too. She wrote her own life story. <laughs> but I was determined to win and nothing was going to stop me. <laughs> Swallowing the worm was easy, but keeping it down was impossible. I threw up <laughs> with the force of a volcano. <laughs> <laughs> what happened to the worm? Oh, it was fine. I saw it in a patch of vomit and it just wriggled away. <laughs> <laughs> and that is how I won the dare game. So I said to Justine Littlewood, you can just bug off. <laughs> 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 I love helping my mum walk the dogs. <laughs> so long. Bye, Jess. Have a good day. Love you. Love you. <laughs> We're not allowed to keep a dog in our flat, but mum says one day we'll buy our own house. And then we'll get a dog who can live with us forever. I believe her, because she always keeps her promises. She's strong and brave. She never, ever cries. She only gets hay fever sometimes. But best of all, she's kind. And that's why my mum, Tracy Beaker, is the person I most admire. Thank you, Jess. Excellent work. It's great to see you building up your confidence. Yeah, but miss, she cheated. I didn't. You just wrote about your mum. Anyone could do that. You couldn't. Tyrone. The people we admire don't have to be famous. Sometimes the people we know, people who inspire us to live our best life. So who inspires you the most? Little Mushy! <laughs> Thank you, Charlie. Very inspirational. Now, 